Welcome back to the channel. This is the baddest man on the planet, the human juggernaut himself, Damien McLeod. Now, the exposing continues. Alpha Destiny, this seems to be a very hard era for you right now. It seems like Jason Blaha is not going to let up. He's not going to let up. He wants the world to know one thing. Your training methods, some of your training methods at least, if not all, are trash. Garbage. They do nothing. They're useless. And to prove his point, he found a clip. Fear use. Played the clip. A, uh, I guess you call him a guru in the science of the body, physical training. This guy was, I, I watched the video. And I'm going to play the clip of it. Just that clip that he used with the fair use with the guy saying himself that these exercises are nothing and they don't work. And when I play this clip, I want you to realize one thing. I already told you this. Now, let's get to it, to the nitty gritty. Let me flip in what Dr. Mike has to say. Um, there's only one exercise I can think of that has a, a worse fatigue to stimulus ratio, and that's um, rack deadlifts or partial deadlifts, which is an exercise in pure fuckery as far as I'm concerned, unless you're a strongman or a powerlifter. And a lot of bodybuilders love to do rack deadlifts because they're too fucking lazy to pick up a deadlift from the ground. Now, who do we know who does these moves? Alpha Destiny. Who's making this ridiculous exercise possible? Alpha Destiny. And to call this thing an exercise, you know, that's, that's a stretch. It's not an exercise. All right? It's not an exercise. It's, it's, oh, it's not even a warm-up. It's nothing. I've said it before. You want big traps? You do shrugs. You do rows. That's how you get your traps big. Not these partial rep things that, whatever this, it just looks crazy because you can put a bunch of weight on the bar and you can show off. But in reality, you're doing nothing. I can walk to, I can walk up <laughs> to the side of a building and I can push, I can push with all my might. And it might look like I'm strong, but the building's not moving, is it? No, it's not. But to the untrained eye, you may think that, oh, he's, he's some kind of special human who's able to push a building down. Look at him, look at that. But there's no result. The building doesn't move. The muscle was not built doing these ridiculous rack pulls. They, it, it does nothing. But let me continue with the video. And they want to be seen lifting big weights and all these fucking idiots are on a shitload of insulin and growth hormone and they're wearing belts all the time to keep their waist small. And then they do the only exercise that can probably actually grow your waist uh, just for the sheer fucking amount of force you're putting through. Now he said, their own growth hormone and insulin. Hmm, didn't I do a video recently saying that someone seems to be using alternative fuel sources? But no, 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 the fanboys, ah, oh, the fucking fanboys, you pansy asses, you just can't seem to, to grasp the concept of common sense, can you? No, you think this is natural, it's not natural, but let me continue. It. It's just baffling. It's just total fucking nonsense. Every time I see anyone do a rack deadlift on social media, I'm like, you're a fucking idiot. Dislike. I wish there was a fucking dislike button uh, on Instagram. But yeah, it just it's, it's, to me, it's like a holy point. It's, it's like, how do you want to get the highest chance of injury, the most fatigue? And then when I ask you what part of your body does that grow, you don't really kind of know. You like everything, brother. Well, that's not a fucking part of your body. Supposedly the spinal erectors, but if you do enough bent over rows and enough stiff legged deadlifts, um, your spinal erectors are not a problem for you anymore. Um, so, uh, yeah, the, the the more full range of motion the deadlift, snatch grip deadlift, deficit deadlift, the more I can start to see an argument, especially for perhaps glute hypertrophy. Exactly. Exactly. I couldn't have said it better my fucking self. You don't need these rack pulls, rack pulls above the knee, and all this fancy. It's not even fancy. It's, it's ridiculous. You're going to break yourself. You know what I'm saying? You're going to break yourself. It's like they say, you're in the, you're in the, the grocery store, don't run around. You can bump into some glass. 
containers and you're gonna break them. Don't do anything reckless. You're gonna break something. Especially if it's done sumo style um, and some good erector hypertrophy and traps and all that stuff. But the uh, more the range of motion decreases for the deadlift, uh, the more it is an exercise in uh, mismanagement of total fatigue and, and injury risk, I think. Especially for bodybuilding. The, shut up, Blaha. You don't get to speak. Now, uh, the, <laughs> the fanboys are not convinced. I know it. Because it's just obvious looking at the exercise, you know it doesn't do shit. All right? But the fact that you got people over there bragging about how much they deadlift, I'm pretty sure there's guys out there trying to go higher than the thousand pounds that Alpha Destiny had done in his video. Trying to exceed that, trying to go 1,100, 1,200 pounds, oh, it's ridiculous. The game has changed, people. The game has changed. The frauds, the fakes, the phonies are taking over. Oh my God, let's all run for the hills, all right? <laughs> Listen, the fitness industry needs a reboot, and I am here. I'm gonna show you guys just what building a natural physique, a powerfully natural physique, Physique. <laughs> Physique. I'm going to show you. Simple as that. I'm going to show you from start to finish what needs to be done in the gym, in the kitchen, for your rest. I've been, it, it's very simple and it doesn't take any drugs. Remember, people, all of these bodybuilders over the years who have been taking drugs. The majority of them end up in one or two places. The hospital or the uh, cemetery. Some go to both. Some go to both. The hospital or the cemetery. And all your Instagram pictures, all your likes and thumbs up on social media, all the prestige you get from the idiots who believe in your fraudulence, in the end, it doesn't even matter. You're gone. How many bodybuilders are gone now? Look at Rich Piana. That guy was a walking laboratory. Where is he now? He, he didn't die a 60, 70 year old man, an 80 year old man. No, he didn't even make it to 50. There's a bunch of 50 year old men healthy out there running around living life, enjoying life with, with his wife and his grandkids, his kids and his grandkids. Living life. Healthy. And then you got these, these foolish people who take these drugs for other people's benefit. For, you know, you know, it doesn't benefit you, but you want people, you know, you're so caught up in what people think about you, your ego your pride, you know what I'm saying? You're willing to do anything to get people's attention. It's called attention whoring. And then where do you end up? What happens to the people who listen to these people? You end up in the same place. You listen to a fool, you're gonna be a fool. Like they always say, if your friend jumps off a bridge, are you gonna jump too? Some of you will, trust me. Some of you already have. But that's all I want to say about this. You know, Jason Blaha, he went another eight minutes or whatever. Blah, 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 blah. And he went, <laughs> Jason Blaha with another eight minutes blah, blah, blah. <laughs> you know, we don't need to hear all of that. But, you know, like I said, people, stay away from the fluff. Do full range of motion exercises. Stay away from the drugs. Stop listening to idiots. If you got a certain amount of people telling you that something someone's doing is fraudulent, listen to the people. Don't be one of those fanboys who says this, this physique is attainable naturally. Uh, you know, because there's other guys who take steroids, they're, they're huge and they don't look anything like this person does. So this impossible, he's taking something because he doesn't look like they do. Shut up, just shut your ass up. Like, so if you haven't already done so, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. I am subliminally in your mind so until next time get to the gym do work muscle up my adversaries cry like hoes fully eradicate my foes my lyrics explode on contact came in you hoes who else but mama's only son but the phony